That's because children are magical. They can be anything. They're nothing but potential. What's up, guys? It is Tuesday, December 14th. It's a week until Christmas Day. Very excited for that. I currently have a crack in my windshield. I'm not sure. Not sure if you can see it. Oh my gosh, you can. And um, I'm in my car. I'm about to go to something very fun with my friend, my good friend Marcos. Shout out to Marcos, man. I have not sat down and talked to the camera in a while. Well, I guess I have. I posted a bunch of videos, but I didn't record those recently. I recorded those like a bit ago. So, um, also, this new Big Time Rush single is so good. Go check it out. And, uh,. Yeah, we're gonna head there. Dude, this is a really hard fence to get through. Man, did you see that? I had to, dude, I had to freaking like duck and roll and. Okay, so as usual, guys, Marcos has yet another spot. I will say though, this is not as like incognito. This, yeah, the difficulty on this mission is easy. Um, so this is the Southport Antique Mall, and then this is an abandoned train. Bro, this has been here for a while too. It's closed. I'm going in. Cover my thing. Just like that. Yes. Did it open? <laughs> it open, dude. I don't know, man. What? I'm scared somebody's living here. This is <laughs> sick. It's like individual rooms. I'm not as nervous about this one either. To the crazy train. <laughs> Toilet. Stop playing. Well, you can just open the, the little door and it just pops out a toilet. Oh my gosh. There's a door. Is it open? Up? No. Hmm. I think it's just the other door to this, though. Bro. <laughs> what is that? Is that blood? No, it's not blood. It's Ew. Paint. Oh, you can, wait, is that, this is a bit, right? I think so. That's way too heavy. That's crazy. Well, guys, I knew this thing was gonna happen. I thought it was gonna be sooner than later. Us. We are. We. First time, bro. <laughs> We're gonna do a vlog in jail next episode. Yo! <laughs> Episode 15. Is it 15? 14? In the cell. The next, our next episode will be like prison lunch. How good is it? It's a good in school lunch. Let's figure this out together. Unboxing. <laughs> Unboxing. Okay, so real talk. We just got out of the train. The reason why the video cut so quick was yeah. Marcos, we were walking toward like the third or fourth room. Like, Mark, I just hear Marcos go, oh, dude, there's a policeman. And I was like, dude. For real? You can't be kidding me. Like we went through an abandoned building and then we go to an abandoned train that's like singular and we get caught there. And so then we like are starting to walk toward the door to leave and we weren't gonna, I don't think we were gonna dip cause like I don't like no, doing that. No, I mean that's, you know, that looks suspicious. Only one exit out too. But like instead we just started walking toward the door and we heard this dude just yell Southport police and I was like, dang it. And so long story short, they took us out, they grabbed our IDs, they informed us that like it's a trespassing violation, like all this stuff. And then we got arrested. No, <laughs> Nothing bad really happened. They just got our uh, ID and they track us our history down. We have nothing bad on us, so this is a good thing. You know, follow our, our steps. It was all tense up until the police was like, <laughs> we're like sitting there waiting for the waiting for the one cop to look at our IDs on the um, computer inside in the, the car. In the car. And then the other guy is like next to us. And we're just standing there in like dead silence for a good like, that was like looking a good the sky, looking five the minutes. <laughs> anywhere but eye contact. And then he just goes like, yeah, he just goes, so you guys uh, explore a lot of abandoned places? And he's just like, cause uh, just so you guys know, like you can contact local police areas and let them know you're going to a place and which you should guys should do yeah from so now on forward he starts explaining that he's gone across the u.s yes. and has gone to like really cool places and literally just like does it for fun and was wondering like what was inside the train so then of course it was like 
did you guys finish exploring the train? And we were like, we got it had there halfway through. No, and he was like, well, if you don't, like, we, we're gonna go patrol it, so if you wanna go check it out. And so we literally ended up walking through this train with these cops, and- It went from two people to four people. I didn't wanna vlog, because obviously I know cops, like, with recording them, it's just weird. And then there was even, like, Marcos asked, and the one guy was like, I don't really like showing my face on camera, so. Mm -hmm. um, that was understandable. Super dope dudes, like, honestly, really cool. But, dude, it was just so much anxiety. <laughs> it was, I'm like, they're gonna like... call my mom, I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> but yeah, we ended up literally exploring the rest of the train with the cops, and then <laughs> we talked to him for like like 30 minutes after That's about right. like about their dog JJ. Oh my god. Uh, JJ, JJ, are you watching this video? Please, please DM me, please. <laughs> Big fan. Oh my goodness. But yeah, um that was that exploration. <laughs> My, dude, I'm so I'm still so shaky from the cold. Well, guys, thank you for watching this very short exploration video. Yes, we're gonna go legally explore things too. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.